Welcome back to our live storm coverage. I want to show you what it's like in Methuen. Our crews are out on the road right now. Most people heeding the warnings to stay off the roads. A lot of plows, though, trying to get their work done before things ice up later tonight. Bill Shields has been following what's been happening down on the Cape. He has been in Sandwich. And uh, Bill, last time we checked in with you, we could see you. Now, wow. not so much. Mostly. <laughs> well, I look better when you can't see me, actually. <laughs> but uh, it, it, <laughs> it is, nothing's really changed down here. Not my face and not the weather. It's still uh, blowing a good steady 40 miles an hour, I would say, maybe gusting up to 50. It's uh, very difficult right now for people to try to move around here. But th I think the worst part of this day was obviously that big high tide at about 1230 today because it was well over 12 feet. And you had the ocean, the wind, pushing the ocean in with it. So it posed big problems here in Sandwich and in Barnstable. The midday high tide was a huge one, over 12 feet. And pushed by high winds, this was the result. Water streaming in by way of a saltwater creek. Several roads here in Sandwich had to be closed until the water receded. Never in 40 years. Eddie Devaney has lived near Town Neck Beach for decades and never has he seen the water in his driveway and inching closer to the house. And this is the first time we have ever seen it up to this level. It's actually, it's in my driveway now. A little uh, disconcerting, I assume. Well, I mean, it's in the Bible, so uh, <laughs> I'm looking for that ark. <laughs> But luckily for Eddie and everyone else down here, it, this, it is now snow. It has changed over from rain in the middle of the afternoon to snow. So I think that's actually a good thing in, term, in terms of flooding. And that tide coming later tonight, it, the wind hopefully will die down and not be pushing that water with that high tide into some of these areas that you saw in some of the videos. So maybe they'll escape. That, that tide at 1230 today, that was the big one. That was the bad one. So hopefully... The worst is over. And, and not a lot of problems down here on the Cape. There are a lot of outages actually in Dennis and some in Yarmouth, but for the in Brewster. But for the most part, people are weathering this pretty well. Reporting live from Sandwich, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. Back to you guys. A ghostly live shot. All right, Bill. Thank you.